and we back, and we back, and we back. It's a new video. I'm not supposed to say welcome back until after the intro. Right? Like, welcome to the video before the intro. <laughs> So wet, bro. Mind on Yahweh, anything else don't die, just white. Sneak her head, the kicks got kicks. You don't want no smoke if you lay not Christ. Icon, icon, that's her in a nutshell. Focused on Christ and it goes well. That's why they still pulling on the coattail. That intro was, it was a mess, wasn't it? Like, it was just, I didn't know what to say. I'm, I'm starting to, to not, you know, this whole, it's just, it's still weird to me, is all I'm saying, the video thing, so. Welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I'm so excited that you are here. I told you I had another video for you. Uh, I made good on that. And so, uh, you saw the title, is All Black Everything. We about to get into my top two. Top two, 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 two. two. You like my sound effects? No? Top two black shoes that I go to, my go-to black shoes. Before I get started on, you know, the shoes and the reviews and all of that stuff, listen, I need you to subscribe. Subscribe to the channel, all right? I need you to like or dislike, whichever works for you. <laughs> and I need you to comment. And then I need you to share because I'm trying to spread this gospel. So I need you all to do those things. And if you feel led, uh, hit that notification bell so that every time I drop a new video, you will be, you know, this is my favorite thing. You will be the first to know. And we all know if you're not first, then, you know, I won't even go there. All right, let's get straight into these shoes. We have the Adidas Twin Strike ADV. Get a good look at that there. I wear my shoes, so before I show you the bottom, relax. That's the bottom. This shoe uh, released, this shoe released April 13, 2018. And it has a lot going on. So of course, you know, you see uh, the leather here is the stretch Nappa leather. Is it Nappa or Nappa? I'm pretty sure it's Nappa. Nappa leather. So, you know, you, you see this now. All, all of the twin strikes don't come uh, made like this. Some of them have other, like they have mesh and such. But what I love most about this shoe um, in terms of just the quality of it is that the majority of it is leather. So the Nappa leather. And then you see hints of the suede overlays here, you know, around the shoelaces. And then uh, the other thing that I think is real cool about this shoe is like the shocks. You, you know, the Nike shocks. I'm, I'm sure you're not supposed to say other brands when you review them, but I mean, I'm different. <laughs> Shout out to Two Chains. Two Chains. I don't even have on Two Chains. What, what's really cool about this shoe is the shock light sole, and it's real comfortable, y'all. Like it's super, super comfortable. My favorite part of the shoe, though, and it's small, but it's so dope to me, is the shoelaces because they're both black and white. I just like that. I, it's it's the details for me. Like, like I said, you know, in my other videos, I like quality, and I like things that are different. I really. Get a good look at those shoelaces. This is real, real cool. Glad I didn't get my makeup on the white part. That would have sucked. But um, there you have it. Twin Strike ADV. ADV just stands for Advanced. Maybe it's the technology in the in the sole. I don't know what why it's considered Advanced, but it got me. They retailed at two hundred and fifty dollars. These are super dope. You are sure to turn heads just because of the sheer cosmetic makeup of the shoe. It's just, it's dope, man. Like, I love these. These are my go-to's, and uh, they clean too, just like they own it. Next up, it's the Yeezy three fifty V two bread. I gotta make sure I say it right. With the Laboose or whatever. Get a good look at that there. Prom knit at the top. You know, you got the red stitching supply 350 on the side. And then of course, you have the red stitching on the pull tab. In the back, what is it, TPU? What? 
TPU midsole is what they call it. I think, I think that's what they call it, TPU missile. I won these in a raffle in the Adidas online drawing. I didn't think I was gonna get it, but I actually did. Shameless plug. This is why it's so important to make sure that your, your finances are under control because the thing about Adidas is, the, the drawing especially, they don't take your money out until the day of the drawing. So that means you gotta make sure that you got that amount of money in your account. And thanks be to God, I was blessed to have that because again, I wasn't expecting to win it. So you gotta make sure that your finances be a good steward of your finances because fam, yeah. So I was blessed to get these at retail at $220. These first released in February of 2017 and then re-released um, December 5th, 2020, if I'm not mistaken. So December 5th. So like I said, originally 2017, restocked in 2020 and i was just super blessed to get them on adidas i was i'm so happy and i never fun fact i never ever touched the laces um, i really don't even normally tie my shoes i'm not even gonna lie i don't know what it is it's just like a cool kid thing to me but i never touched the shoelaces so this is the original uh packaging of the shoelaces and i just slide my foot up in them and you know make them make them look dope so there you have it easy 350 breads yeah you know why i'm here right i i literally come bearing the good news then the scripture for today comes from john 1 and 5 and it says the light shines in the darkness and the darkness does not overcome it the light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it you know the, the the it's it's crazy to me how we are in such man perilous times listen we texas texas in the southern southern like in the south with an f again shout out to two chains we just had a whole snowstorm fam like out of nowhere it was crazy and so uh you know tons of people were were out of power and which means you know they weren't able to get heat or uh, to preserve their food and their refrigerator. It's just, it's just been super, super crazy. Then, you know, you add on top of that, just the, a new, the, the numerous amount of just racism that we've seen. And, and it's, it's always been there, but it's been really uncovered for the past four years due to a person that kind of, that will remain nameless because I don't want to go into politics, but I just, I felt it very appropriate to to post this, um, especially being that it's Love Month. I thought it was just this was just the right time. Just talk about how, um, in reference to the scripture, how even in the darkness the light shines the brightest. Light is its brightest when the environment is the darkest. So what am I saying? What I'm saying is, if we are to be the light, which we are called to be as Christians, we are called to be the light, not just salt, but it literally talks about us being a light on a hill, right? That cannot be hid. And 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 even though, you know, everything around us just seems to be so dark and just ridiculous, you know, and and and, and heartbreaking and disturbing. Us being that light, we bring that joy, to bring that truth, bring that dopeness that that we bring and, and in all actuality i'm not even really just talking about black people now don't get me wrong now you know us as black people man we we i say it all the time and i'm gonna say it again and, and again i want to preface the conversation with this that me saying this it's not putting any other race down i'm going to repeat that again me saying what i'm about to say is me not not putting any other race down period and so with that, I just really want to make sure that I say, man, again, I've said it before, but man, the Lord did his thing when he made black people, period. This isn't up for debate. You can comment and say whatever you want. I'm, I'm just that emphatically bold about this. But aside from that, as Christians, and it's crazy because... Uh, Martin Luther King did a speech about this, how, you know, if you were to look up the word black, they put it in this negative connotation. But I love being black. It's dangerous. But I love being black. 
<laughs> like it's just to me it's nothing better even despite all of the hardships and and even with the challenges being black is amazing and so and then you add on top of that i'm a christian it's just like man god you know what you was doing like you you knew what you were doing and i i'm here for it but really what i just what i wanted to make sure that i convey today is just the fact that as christians as christians man we were we were called to be this light this light in the world um in any situation we are to bring the light with us we shine regardless why because we have christ inside of us and when you have christ inside of you it's kind of inevitable like the light is going to shine its brightest especially when you're in your darkest hardest deepest times just here to remind you just here to encourage you man keep shining don't stop i know that it's difficult and i know that there are spirits and principalities and in circumstances and situations that are happening and that we're all going through that come to derail us and try to convince us that you know what's the point here's the point god's name needs to be glorified and while he could use the trees and you know the earth he he's chosen us as image bearers we out of all the things we were the ones made in his image humankind we were made in his image and while he could have chosen anything he chose us and that's why it's important that we shine in the darkness um yeah that's all I have for you today. I don't, I don't really have, I don't even much have nothing else. <laughs> I hope that you subscribe to the channel. You can like or dislike, whatever you decide to do. So hit that thumbs up, preferably. Comment, love, share, and help me spread this gospel. And I'm out of here. Until next month, y'all be good, man. Keep shining.